What's going on, everybody? I'm Captain Robert, and this is totally not an hour and a half later through reboot and Windows Update L. <laughs> I'm so glad we got here, though. I mean, we reached a good place. <laughs> Welcome, everybody. Eberron, Arc 1, Episode 2. You know what? I'll finally, I'll finally update the stream on that, too. <laughs> Don't worry, we'd only got to shut down and redo the whole stream again just to do that. <laughs> no. Board again. Aww. One more time. <laughs> Boom. Oh my God. There we go. Things are running. I gotta restart stream. Oh, yeah. <laughs> One more time. <laughs> Thank you. At least Adam understands my musical references. Yeah, oh. I got it. I just didn't like it. <laughs> yeah. But you know what? Don't hate Daft Punk. They're tired now. They got their no, AARP you know card in the mail and said, see ya. Exactly. The, the, I didn't. I didn't watch you when you came and stood with your silhouette at the door either. <laughs> that was best. I'm gonna give you a hug when I see you. We're gonna mend that. We're gonna mend that wound. Deathwork is amazing. I love those guys. So <laughs> welcome, welcome everybody. Appreciate you guys hanging with us. Well, we got everything sorted. You guys can see the stream over on Discord, correct? Huh? 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 Yes. Yeah. Awesome. We can. Boom. You live in. in Color TV vision. Oh, I thought you were going to say La Vida Loca. I was waiting for you. I was like, why is he outside, inside out, living to be La Loca? Oh, As man. you can see, chat, we've gone off the deep end. <laughs> I, I, I will say, Ricky oh, Martin shit. did make my seventh grade dance better because that was a banger. <laughs> It really was. It's you can't you can't take away from that track, man. It's fantastic. Wow. I can't not take away the image of seventh grade Captain Robert shaking to live in La Vida Loca. I uh, I wore Oof. a bowling shirt and a fedora to my seventh grade dance. Oh my god! Yeah. Unironic uh, fedora. Was, mine was plaid MC Hammer pants. <laughs> yeah. How do y'all remember this? Neck with a giant golden chain. <laughs> That's impressive. That is impressive. Oh, good too. It was so good. And I had my hair swooped over. I was ready to party, dude. Yeah. Cletus, you and I were meant shit. to be lifelong bards mm. together. <laughs> Please, I, I gotta go over and get some of this orange concentrate punch over here. Mm. Oh, so good. Oh. Trace, please deliver us from evil and let us know when you're playing D&D &D this week. Well, this week we have uh, two D and D shows going on over at my channel. On Fridays, we have D and D Descent into Avernus on Fridays at. 6 p.m. Pacific, and then on Sundays, Adam and I play together in Icewind Dale, Rhyme of the Frost Maiden, over at my channel. Also at 3 p.m. Pacific, so feel free to join us and and watch the uh, the perils that we face in Icewind Dale right now. Uh, it's it's been it's been interesting, but yeah, that's what I got going on. Yo, Cletus, you got a stream on Saturday? Yeah, we're doing. Uh... Oh God, I forgot. <laughs> Planet side? Planet side. Planet side. Sorry, I, I haven't played that game very much, so I keep forgetting what the hell it's called. Had all Did Borderlands that time to prepare. 3 or Planet Side 2 or no. So the late shift are doing Planet Side 2 event for the company, and we're gonna be getting like all of our communities together on one giant map to fight another team. So it's gonna be chaos. Let's go. Hey, you know what? We got to do one, uh, you know, one last piece of crazy. It looks like Discord stream is Bork now. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's full. Oh, no, there it goes. There it goes. Well, that's fine good for me. me. It's yeah. good for me. Hey, let's go. It was, uh, it was hanging around 40% resources there for a second. <laughs> it was having a good time. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. So we're going to start this bad boy so we can get some. Yeah, uh, <laughs> Go in and actually kill something in stream. Uh, <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this isn't good. Oh no. Now what? No. <laughs> no. Don't no. say that. Don't say that. Outside, inside, outside, 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 outside,
<laughs> just, Adam, just entertain Adam, us, Adam. 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 Let's, let's roll the intro song. Cricket noise. Meanwhile, Robert is like crying inside right now. I'm totally crying inside over here. No. Sounds like he needs a voodoo ranger. Oh he man, does. he's gonna need more than one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about halfway Peter through Ranger, the first. If you're watching. Send him, uh, send him a few six packs. He's gonna need it. <laughs> yeah, appreciate your sponsorship over the course of the entire year, Voodoo Ranger. You guys are my heroes. Thank you. Mm. Okay, no Discord thank, stream thank tonight. Thank you, Voodoo Ranger, for your sponsorship, even though Chrome sucks right now. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, Cro I can't Hey, Chrome is fixed. Now it's Discord that's going in between uh, 14 and 40% resources. So, you know, good times. <laughs> yeah, I see. My, uh, my poor little system just can't keep up with that. <laughs> cool. I think we're good. So we're going to start back in this bad boy. Picking up where we left off last week. With this ragtag group of individuals gathering inside Cletus's tavern. It was not long before the mere moments of where and why they arrived. You guys have been overtaken by a whole mass of lizard folk. We are picking back up in the middle of that combat. Now, we just got done uh, with my turn. So we're going to be picking up inside this order. Let's see where we're at here. Where's that metal music? Oh, don't you worry. Don't you worry. Now is the perfect time. <laughs> <laughs> Upside, inside. <laughs> just starts playing. <laughs> if anything ever needed to get thrashed out, it was now. Picking up inside mm. that combat order. I'm looking through here. There it is. Yes. That's what I'm in for right now. This is why I showed up tonight. I believe it's Latesh, right? Uh, no, I did my turn and then I was, I inspired recoil. recoil to do his turn as well. Yeah. Before we finally. So now it's lizards. Yeah, we were going to do my turn, and then he was like, no, we got to keep going. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we just finished mine. I tried to shoot the uh, the dude in the outhouse. <laughs> yeah. And I, I failed miserably. I'm expecting Matt Heafy to come sing in this on this track for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> he did finish off the rest of the turds that were on that, uh, that eastern side, though. So I Eastern mean. side, they did get flamed. So they're gone. They're done. Dead. Next giant lizard. Oh, that one's dead too. Yeah, that one's dead over on this side. Garomesh, it is your turn, my dude. All right. Okay. <laughs> All right. So we still got that. We still got him. Well, let me pull up my cool stuff here. Um, would I still be considered hidden? No, you're not hidden. The minute okay. you took your first shot, you popped out of being hidden. You would have to hide again on your to. bonus action. You are correct. All right. I think I'm going to peek out this way and go out and shoot after some big baddie here. This guy, right? No. Let's see. Is right, the we'll lava with, still uh, going under him? Heavy crossbow. Yeah, the erupting earth is still going on still underneath going. there. That is a 26 to hit. 26 will Ooh. do the job. <laughs> Damn. Uh, hit him hard now. Okay, just making sure here. Okay. That's six points of piercing. Six points of piercing damage. 
and then I'll immediately take both my extra attack and my bonus action attack with both my hand crossbow. 15 to hit. 15 will not hit. All right, and 23 to hit. 23 will hit. And then that's seven points of piercing damage. And then, so I moved five, 10, uh, where's my, ooh, I like that, let's go. Yeah. Go back to the point. You could probably start uh, working on that big dude by the outhouse, right? <laughs> I'm a real worried he's going to get into the pooper, man, and we don't want that. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody wants <laughs> demon. And I think <laughs> it's a Golgothan. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, that would be you my turn. Bar Just without your pooper. <laughs> three quick pop shots, and then as I'm, as I'm running to another cover. There you go. Well done. Well done. Big boys down by the door. Still got those steak knives spinning around them up at the front, but mm -hmm. they are hell bent on bashing this door in. All right. I'll huff and I'll puff. We're gonna blow this house down. Big clubs coming in. All right. So is it the end of their turn they take the, the knife damage? Yes, sir. Is that how that works? Okay, cool. Yes, sir. These were uh, these guys were one d eight. Oh God! Come on, struggle bus over here, man. The struggle <laughs> bus is real. All right, these guys are plus six. Let's go. First one's not going to be able to find purchase on that door. Second shot at it. Door is. <laughs> <laughs> yes. My my tonight rolls are just as hot tonight as my production skills. This guy's going to go. Uh, the guy next to him swinging in. These are plus six. 19's going to hit. All they got to do is get ten or a. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> let's go. All right, one of those. Uh, this lizard, BFG lizard, right over here. Oh my. Okay, so my pings are gone. <laughs> oh, there, there we go. Did somebody else ping them for me. Thank you. Yeah, right. I got you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. That lizard's gonna take maximum damage, uh, so it's gonna take all of them from your crit. So go ahead and roll, uh, roll the first knife. Um, and that is. It'll be uh, over on yours. Mm -hmm. And then I'll just roll four d four. Yep. Okay, rolling it. Oh, it didn't roll. Did you do the? Uh, did you click the uh, the B up on Chrome so that it re uh, relinked? Uh, it's opening up a little box and won't let me touch the. Is that because of the B? Yeah, you gotta hit the uh, gotta hit the B so it it sinks back in. Okay. Huh. It hit the B. Let me try one more time here. 
Is there anything else I could be doing? Because I hit the B and it's still bringing up the box that's keeping me from rolling. You may need to go ahead and just refresh your uh, foundry tab and then click the okay. B right at the very beginning. The yeah, you got to click the B in both foundry and uh, D and D beyond. Okay, going back. Sorry, guys. Uh, don't you, you so don't you worry, man. We got all the patience. <laughs> There, there it goes. goes. Let's go. Is that one leaning? <laughs> I think that one was leaning. Uh, the good news is the ones uh, uh the stream saw they were all upright. All right. Okay, so, um, so you did eight eight points of slashing damage on the guy on the left, and it's four uh four d fours. So twelve is your max. Twelve to the dude on the right. Lizard folk on the right, he is bloodied. Bloodied. He's taking steak knives to the face right now. <laughs> Straight up. Boom. That's going to end their turn. Still beating on the door. Oh. Big lizard commander boy. <laughs> Big boy. <laughs> it's going to get away from this erupting earth. That's the first thing. First things first. Going to back up off of this pile. I'm assuming going to go ahead and roll damage on that uh, on that eruption uh, right there. Let me double check here. I know it's a d difficult terrain. Uh, I think he's actually okay. It's just more difficult for him to leave that area. <laughs> Probably just moves slower. Yeah. Could yeah, take... he doesn't have to take any damage. Cool. It's going to be, uh, it'll take half of his movement getting across that spot. He's going to keep his eyes still up over towards yours, Trace. Yeah, I pissed him off. <laughs> it's just slowly <laughs> backing that lizard up. He's going to use the dash action. Oh, God. It's going to try and jump up on top of the roof. Oh, oh god. god. Oh. <laughs> Let's hope for a roof. nat one athletics check on this jump from this, this big is a lizard. Rickety roof. Oh no, it is a rickety roof, isn't it? Oh, oh no. I was fighting next year of having some work done. <laughs> you got this great bar, but you got this crappy roof. Oh, no. I knew I He's got like all of somewhere. these like iron really gates on the doors and, and everything, but the roof's got here. holes in them. <laughs> It does look like it's not looking good on oh, the map. Oh, it's too. yeah, it's got a few, <laughs> it's got a few spot <laughs> patches there. Do you realize how often I actually get lizard attacks around here? <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you've been pretty well armored up for it so far. I mean, damn, you All forget right. the roof that they can jump. I've been meaning to fix that. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to home ownership, right there. Here we go. The roof is still made out of paper. Advantage <laughs> plus eight coming in. Oh. 15 on the first. Eighteen on the second. Gonna make the DC of sixteen just barely. Uh oh. <laughs> As it backs up a little bit with its dash. Jumping up towards the top of the roof. Vess, I need you to make a strength saving throw. All righty. Come on, Vess. Come on, D and D Beyond. Roll. One sec. Oh, oh. <laughs> wow. Did it one more by <laughs> three of them? Oh, it just it wasn't registering. For me. <laughs> click, what? click, 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 click. We can go with that first one there. That's that lovely seven. <laughs> oh no. Oh well. 
this as it slams to the top of the roof. You immediately lose your footing. I need you to make a dexterity saving throw. Oh, that's probably not going to be very good either. Eight. Oh! <laughs> Nat 20 was right there. Oh. Oh, oh. You are going to lose your footing and you are going to fall to the ground here. 2d6. You're going to take three points of bludgeoning damage as you fall to the ground. Does anything else happen from the fall or is it just the bludgeoning damage? Like, does she actually take any other type of damage or? No, just the bludgeoning from the fall. Okay, cool. Yep. Just the fall damage. So she probably was able to handle the fall pretty easily. Yeah, I mean, yeah, as as good as that bruised hip bone. <laughs> yeah, gonna have a nice bruised hip for a couple of days. Let's see who's up here: Cletus, Latash, and Recoil. You can see as this <laughs> it's massive giant lizard that is up on top of Cletus's tavern. I'm, on, I'm inside, remember? Don't forget, oh, that's I'm right. Inside. That's right. That's right. You're inside. I'm You're in inside the, the tavern. I can hear the rumbles, but I ain't seen nothing yet. I'm going to have you make face. a strength saving throw for your tavern. Oh, this is going to be a 1d20 plus 10 for this structure. So all, the, all that you'll need to do is go down to the bottom bar and click that. Uh, click one of the d20s and roll it. Uh, bottom bar in this program? Yeah, inside Foundry. Okay, I don't believe I have one set up. No, it's it's there, it's on the dice tray. So if you go to rolls and you go all the way down, you'll see an emblem of a uh, D20 and you'll just click that emblem of the D20 and you'll hit roll. Let me verify with you. We're talking in, in Foundry, right? Yeah, in Foundry, Rolls tab. You go all the way to the bottom right-hand corner, and you'll see this little dice tray that's there. It's under the first bubble, the chat log bubble. Far left-hand side of that uh, that right-hand side bar where everything is. It's probably when you click uh, at, the, at the very... So to get there, there's the chat bubbles at the top left-hand side of this mm -hmm. column. Oh, I see it. I now you it. need now Same you have here. to click on rolls to be able to see the rolls there. Yeah, and then you go all the way down to the bottom of it. Uh roll won't do anything. You got to oh, rolls. I see rolls now. Okay. You got to click the emblem of the D20 and then click roll. There we go. Ooh. Let's go. 28. Damn. Boy. More than enough. Cletus's I'll tavern. For my tavern. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky enough, he hops right on one of those support beams, baby. I just put that support beam in yesterday, too. <laughs> uh, thank God. It's being on up with little rickety like uh, plates and it's barely holding on. Umber, it is your turn. <clears throat> All right. So seeing Garamesh have the nice shot on the uh, big guy, um, but then seeing him jump up on the roof, I'm going to glance over to my left and see this other lizard by the outhouse. Um, and I'm just going to turn and look at Garamesh and say, Kalimvor willing, I shall guide you. And you're going to see me close my eyes and I'm just going to reach my hand out back towards the tree and the wind and the dirt is going to start to like swirl towards me. And you're going to start to see like a, a small string of fireflies kind of coalesce around my arm and I'm going to turn and towards the lizard, I will cast guiding bolt. Let's go. And hope I hit. <laughs> oh, well, it rolled damage too, but a nine. <laughs> <laughs> Nine will I not hit. I have a D10. Can I use it? Absolutely. That's a D12. <laughs> Come on. Twelve. <laughs> Twelve damage. Twelve is no, just, just the AC. 
Let's go! <laughs> so then, yeah, he'll take uh, 16 radiant damage. 16 points of radiant damage. And then the next attack on it has advantage. And then uh, I will use my movement to... Uh, Oh, oh. Didn't do that. that was cool, though. That was awesome. <laughs> that was cool, though. That's for Asher. Um, Chat, you'll get to see all uh, sorts yeah. of cool shit like that eventually. Oh, <laughs> dude. That's awesome. <laughs> That's pretty sick. I can't wait to get that That's all automated. <laughs> yeah, that, that'll be that'll be great. Um, and then, yeah, so I will move 40 feet closer to uh this one, and then I'll just do uh, like a uh, patient defense. You said 16 points of radiant damage? Yes. Cool. It is on death's door. All right. End of your turn. Western. Those guys are all done. They did. Hey, the uh, the roof didn't take any damage, did it? No, roof didn't take any damage. Cool. Nope, that was all all on your save. Gotcha. Big lizard out by the outhouse. <laughs> Thanks for getting me off the uh. uh, uh. <laughs> Off wait, which... wait, just stop there. <laughs> <laughs> Shay, grab the clip, send it to me later. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You know, it's funny when you told me to wait. I didn't register the pun in my head because it hadn't yet. I honestly thought that you you would use booming blade. When players tell me to wait, it's usually booming blade damage. This, <laughs> this is my life right now. I'm like, okay, make the roll. <laughs> <laughs> Lizard's coming for your ass. It's going in for and a I bite. Have a dodge action. So I think he has disadvantage. Disadvantage? Let's go. Yeah. Oh, that won't get it done. First bite will miss. Second bite coming in. Disadvantage. Ooh. Oof. That'll hit. Damn, that one's going to hit for sure. Yeah. Mm hmm. <laughs> With a whopping four points of piercing damage <laughs> as it locks down on your leg. Golly. Through my temp hit points now, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Vess, it is your turn way over here, down on the ground. <laughs> yeah, now that I, I like get up, I like I probably fall to the barrel or something and I'm like, oh, and I like pick up and grab my back for a second. <laughs> um, I see these two down here and they're trying real hard to get in. Um, I'm going to try to stop them. So I think I'm going to cast Thorn Whip. So um, you see Vess kind of like extend her hand and this like weave of thorny strands uh, comes out of her palm and I'm gonna try to wrap this first guy um, so let's see what he has I think he has to make a oh no I just make an attack all right let's see <clears throat> all right oh was that a net 20 no that's just the 20 that's an 18. Why does it why does it show green like it's a net 20? All right, yeah, it showed 18 for me. Uh, six piercing damage to the sky. Six points of piercing damage. And then. I can actually pull him toward me, um, so I'm going to like I wrap the, the the whip around him and I start like pulling him in. You can do one like size right. larger than you with uh with the uh, thorn whip. Yes. Awesome. Uh, the creature is large or smaller. 
Does that pull him out of the blades? Hmm. That's a good point, because he would take more damage, wouldn't he? Any yeah, time, he take more damage. Anytime you were pulled against your will in 5th edition D&D, you don't take the damage. Right. All right, six points of thorn whip damage, and you're gonna pull this thing closer to you. And, <sighs> yeah, yeah, and I think that is my turn. Any bonus action? Um, just looking now. Nope, I think. I think that's it for me. Yep, no bonus action. All right, check it on stream loots. Uh, have uh, have your cards not been showing up? Is it the first one to show up? Because if not, I'll refund. I'll send all those cards back if they haven't been rolling. <laughs> I just noticed for, it right now. For me? No, nope, they've been showing. Uh, okay, cool. Chat. I just oh, want to make sure because I, oh. I forgot to start uh, when I did the uh, restart oh, to check to make sure that uh, streamless were displaying. Awesome. Okay, but they were they were in chat. They just weren't on screen. Got it. Sweet, 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 sweet. All right, now you got a big lizard boy in front of you, Cletus. Top of the round. It is your turn inside the tavern, my dude. Um. So you said that. How much damage is the front door taken so far out of its total health of 50? Do you show an amount? I'm looking for it. Looking where, okay. where I saved it in my notes. The front door itself has 30 HP left on it before it busts open. Okay. Out of um, 50. I, I think I'm going to go fix it on the fly. So we keep those sons of sons of lizards out of our tavern. <laughs> uh, but can, it, does that count as my move, my one move for the turn, or how does that work? So can I do a repair on the fly, or you can repair on the fly? It will. Uh, you can use your. You can literally use cure wounds to enact that repair, and that will give you uh, wh whatever level you cast it at. It'll consume your action, but you'll have your bonus action left. And can uh, blindness or deafness be used as a bonus action, or is that not one? No, that is your that is an action. So now, what? Here's what okay. you can do: you can use healing word uh, as your as your bonus action to like mend this door, and then I can oh, okay. I'll let you I will let you use your. Uh, one other question: Does blindness or deafness have to be directly looking at them, or can it be through the roof? Good question. It'll I'll look cast it through the roof. I'm gonna look on it right now. If you have to okay. see them, um, well, I can see his face. One creature you can you can see within range, so you have to yeah. see, be able to have eye contact, thirty feet away. Okay. Do we count that crack in the roof, or is that not gonna be counted? <laughs> crack on the roof Just ain't gonna work this time. Gotcha. That's fine. That's fine. Just making sure. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and heal the door with healing word. He's asking the radio questions now. <laughs> yeah. right. Right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You Listen, keep asking you, those questions. You tell me there's dirt on the roof. Can I move that dirt? Actually, okay, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Since this is your this is, since this is your tavern, and you know every creak and crack inside this sucker, I will let you roll a perception check with advantage. To look up and see that creature at just the right hole. What's okay. DC? I'll take that. DC is going to be 18. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what you got. Come on, Cletus. Uh, is you just rolling off perception right now? Yeah, you can yep. roll perception with advantage. Uh, how do I add the advantage? Just, roll, just it roll it twice. twice. There you go. Oh, it was right there. Oh, Damn. You, you're looking. You can see that big ass lizard up there, but you're just not able to find the right angle to be able to see into its eyes. Okay. Good thought, though. I'm going to go ahead and take my opportunity now 
that she pulled away the other one and I'm going to cast healing word on the front door and <laughs> attempt to bring it back to uh, full health. All right. Um, and I do I have to roll anything other than healing word? Is that it? Just you boom. just get to yeah, you just get to do it. Boom, rolling it. Nice, good heal. Yeah. Now this is new new for this campaign. First heal that's in. I want you to throw just a regular D twenty. All right, so I'm rolling for crit heals in this campaign. Ooh, ooh, okay. so he, I wonder where that was going. Yeah, heals have a uh, heals have a five percent chance to be able to crit. So, yeah. all right, seven points back onto the door. It's back up to thirty-seven. There we go. Still all have right, your full it, action left. I am going to move to this window here. Oh man, I wish I understood these moves a little bit better. I'm learning guys, I'm learning. Um, You're in the D&D safe space. <laughs> you can do it, Peter. <laughs> you can do it. You just have to believe. You're playing with us. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think the only thing I can really do is either heal. I don't really have any damaging spells that I can do because I can't target anything. Yeah, um, it, it'll, also, it'll it'll take the uh, the daggers will go away the minute you cast another offensive spell. Yeah. Um, can I use calm emotions on her? Maybe see if that helps. Calm emotions on who? On uh, Vess. Well, Vess isn't uh, isn't in any kind of distress. So <laughs> I didn't know if she was in distress out there. No, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm oh. good. I don't have really anything. You can lean out one of those windows and shoot your elder blast at that first big lizard right here. Okay, we can try that. Do we? Actually, I think there is a side window there anyway. So I'm probably looking right at him, actually. Yeah, you can lean out that some bitch and fire off <laughs> two elder blast. And then the, the the daggers are gone then, right? I no, this those. is just a cantrip, so you get to keep concentration on the daggers. Okay, good. Do you have to roll the uh, D21 first, but we'll keep the we'll, we'll keep those two pieces of damage, mm -hmm. a nine and an eight. It's as you prop yourself up on uh, on Bill on Bill's old chair, his damn his damn ass is wallered one of those <laughs> one of those posts right out, and you just slip down. You hit your arm, oh, cut up on the windowsill. Vess, you're gonna take nine points from that first elder oh. blast. Oh, 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 oh no! Damn. I'm a horrible <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ow. Better than my damn lizard folk. Ow. <laughs> I'll, make you some more. I'll make you some more of that dwarven bread when we're done. That'll make up for it. For sure. It will. I think that's I think that's my turn. Carbs for Elder Blasts. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Laytash, you're staring in the eyes of two massive lizards up on this roof. I was not expecting two massive lizards to show up on my roof. Yeah. I was putting on the ultimate of Caius Rock concerts up here. So uh, as as I turn and am surprised by this giant lizard that's crawling on the roof. I go ahead and go full drop C and drop the other <laughs> five strings on the guitar since I've already gone into drop D and I'm going to cast uh, Thunder Wave as I strum nice. those guitar strings at 
both those uh, uh, wonderful, wonderful lizard folk. They're going to need a con save of 14. Con save of 14. All right, since they're mounted, this is going to be this going to be a joint. All right. Advantage roll coming in. Oh. Oh. Well, Nat 20. I guess they don't take the uh, the thunder damage either. They're not impressed by my rock show. They were not impressed. We were, though. We enjoyed it. Well, I mean, who doesn't like a little deep courting? <laughs> mm. This will be where you die. Holding their ground. Wee! Yeah. I am. I'm going to slide off the edge of this roof. Yeah. I'm going up there. I just got the absolute scare out of me. I am literally jumping off this other side to slide down. It's a, I mean, it's a one of these roofs, right? By, by the picture that I'm looking at. Yeah, you should slide down. It's just an angled roof. Acrobatics check. Twenty one. Twenty one. You'll be able to do so. Slide all the way down to the ground. Maybe land on this guy who's sitting at the bottom of me. <laughs> Can you actually bop him on the head or is it That's kind of what I'm doing. I'm, I'm like, oh, there's somebody <laughs> down there and he's a lizard guy. I'm going to try and slide down this roof and fall on his head. <laughs> All right. So improvised attack. <laughs> yep. What do you want me to do? Well, you're going to roll on that. Uh, it's just like your uh, just like your regular unarmed strike. Yeah, probably unarmed. Oh, 16 to hit. 16, I believe, does the trick. <laughs> but yeah. slam him as I come off the roof. <laughs> let's go. Let's let's go, Bowser. Go ahead, roll for damage. <laughs> one damage. <laughs> yeah, it, it literally just gives me a one <laughs> for my for my unarmed strike damage. I just kind of fall on him and it... <laughs> you catch a little bit of his ear. <laughs> just hear a loud fart noise. That's it. <laughs> action movement anything for your bonus action latash oh um god i wish i could use a cantrip right now that'd be real nice um no unfortunately i'm uh i'm all out of bonus actions well damn it now i just realized that i'm up here on the roof by myself <laughs> yep. All alone. Uh, yep. Recoil, you're going to get I'm me in trouble already. Uh, I'm a coming. Not one to back down. Aren't you just a big bastard? <laughs> He's going to reload. I'm going to switch that bitch back over to my Eldritch Cannon. I'm going to shoot. Shoot to kill. Oh, that's not going to do it. 15. Oh. Shot flies up and over as she's able to dodge and get out of the way. Is this the big one on the roof? Yeah, this is the big one on the roof. Oh, no. Now I'm you just pissed him off. <laughs> <clears throat> Let's see how much you like flame. I'm gonna flip the switch. I'm gonna go for the uh the the the, the 
the flame cannon on it. Dexterity 15. Lizard Commander's got advantage. He's mounted up at the moment. Plus five on this save. Oh. Oh man. Oh, oh my god. god. Eat there, Owen. Well. God. Wow. This guy in his rolls so right good. now. Takes no damage. Mmm. Oh my god. This is why I slid off the roof. <laughs> mm. Cletus? What's that? The roof is on fire. <laughs> oh god! Oh, that's right, you shot fire at him. No! <laughs> with that with that twenty. Oh no. The roof is on fire. <sighs> Uh, we don't need no, no water. Let the <laughs> on fire. I just start going recoil. <laughs> uh, maybe fire was a bad choice. Uh, Do you shit. think? <laughs> I didn't think of roll twenty. Uh, Twice. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to. I'm going to jump off the roof. Athletics check. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just, just leave it there. <laughs> Why don't you switch that hand cannon into water, please? Let's get that going. I don't have a super soaker 50. I can't do anything about it. Uh, hold on. Do I have anything I could do about it? Should I stay at? Oh, actually, you know what? I'm not. I'm not going to jump off. I'm not jumping off. I'm not going to jump off. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put this fire out. When I get a chance, you can actually put my fire out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hide behind this chimney though. I'm gonna give myself. Right, just let's, let's make a three quarters cover. Here. How much health does the roof have compared to the doors? Well, uh, the uh, compared to the uh, compared to the, the doors, I'm gonna set the I'm gonna set the roof up at about thirty. Okay, and your fire is gonna do how much? Per I just turn? did sixteen. <laughs> Which is just, I just did half. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go get a ladder next turn. <laughs> ladder. I think I have one in the back, step stool. Don't worry, I, I, I can. Hey, I can. Bill, <laughs> Bill, can you grab that ladder? <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try to thunder. Grab me that step stool. Come on, I'm, Bill. I'm gonna try to thunder wave it. I'm gonna. Uh, okay, what the hell does that do? What are you gonna do to my roof? I just, I just tried to thunder wave him and it didn't work out so well. So we'll see what happens when he tries it. <laughs> All right, Garamesh, it is your turn. Okay. <clears throat> oh yeah, you're so... over here now. Shit, shit has changed since round one. <laughs> <laughs> it has changed a lot. <laughs> Um, is, uh, this guy still glowing? Yep. All right. The... Uh, I'm going to take sharpshooter on this one. So... So there'll be a 16 after the sharpshooter. And you're shooting one of the large, large lizards. This guy here, yeah. Oh yeah, that hits. Okay. Uh, did I set that up yet? No, I didn't. Okay. Uh. Bloop. All right. Nope. Wrong one. There you go. So that is actually 24 points of damage with the plus 10 on it. <laughs> 24 points of damage. Oh yeah, yep. D DTD. That thing is done. <clears throat> so is it as a big I, one? Yeah. As I'm Nine. seeing seeing him him start to to crunch down on uh uh Umber, 
there. I just take and just take a pot shot to the back of the skull. Let's go. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> that was <Nice>. cool. <laughs> so somehow that one, it's like scaling is messed up because the laser's large. Like the explosion is just massive. <laughs> big lizard, big explosion. Let's go. And then I can see the the little guy here, right? Because uh, yeah, you can uh, see them now. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'll take two pops at him. Thank you for not shooting a one on that. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh. uh, 18, what's that? Yeah, 18 and a 12. 18 hits, 12 does not. All right, I'll use a superiority die oh. on the 12. And that becomes an, uh, another 18. 18 hits. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> So that's 19 points of damage total on him. 19 this points of damage. Rude to Tim and I deflect missiles and catch one. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Cause wow. I can. I'm kidding. How did you know that was the blue one? Nice. <laughs> that lizard is on death's door. Ooh. Um... No, I'll save it. I'll save it. Um. And then I will. Can I see the big lizard, you know, in in Euclidean terms? <laughs> the the guy up on top. Oh yeah. From where I am, or yeah. he should be able to. He's huge. Yeah, he's, he's massive. Be a big dude up there. Okay. I'll just tuck back behind here then. And I believe that's action, bonus action. Action, action, bonus action. We're good. Cool. D you know, dagger, 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 but not. <laughs> <laughs> Big lizard's dead, so it's out of the torn turn order. Just uh, the lizard folk that is on a death's door back here. Ah, oh, man, I wish my freaking pings worked, man. <laughs> Story of my life over here. <laughs> Radio's got it. God, who to swing at? I mean, I just kind of fell on your head, so I'm... <laughs> <laughs> He's probably pissed. <laughs> not, not that I just shot I don't two even arrows like into your you. music. <laughs> <laughs> attacks you. Get, get, not four get, lizard people. Got destroyed from the west, but it's like... Argh! It's going to swing its club over at you. Bring it. Club action coming in. I'm gonna die. Oh, oh, yeah. I'm gonna no. die. <laughs> wow. Will you quit throwing 20s? Right? <laughs> I'm just like, hmm, how do I max damage? <gasps> oh, Chihuahua. Fives. 12 points on that great club. <laughs> As it strikes down, swinging back at you again. 13 will just do it. Oof. Bards. Another Ow. eight points. Jeez. Oh, Ow. Taking all attempt. Got bonked. After two successful hits, it's also going to use its spike shield on you as well to try to knock you back. God, God, stop. <laughs> <laughs> All right, another eight full comboing you. points of damage. Really? You need to make a strength saving throw. Thirteen. Thirteen. You will fail. You're going to be knocked prone as well. Five feet back. Poor Tesh. <laughs> this changes everything. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.
hey, if my lizard folks had done this from the beginning, they wouldn't have looked like such chumps. But uh, <laughs> they, they missed most of their attacks on a building that can't move. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, that lo lizard just lording over you. Yeah, it's gonna, it's going in for the kill. End it's of this turn. Surging on me. Get out of here. <laughs> Doesn't have an action surge. It's just Thank taking its step forward. <laughs> I was gonna say I thought I was like going in for more attacks. I was like, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> All right, end of their turn. Oh no. Big Lizard Commander is going to take its sword out and is going to charge recoil. <laughs> Coming in at me with mounted momentum. Great Weapon Master with its long sword. I got a little bit of cover from this chimney, so my AC is gonna go up two points. Oh, thank God. That's 21 is where it's at. Here's this roll. Even with Great Weapon Master, it is still a plus eight on oh, this geez. roll. Here it comes. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Cletus's chimney taking the full brunt of that swipe. <laughs> oh, no. Bricks just go flying. No. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> One more of those strikes incoming. Great Weapon Master at least does not have the, the, the momentum of riding in. Another D20 plus eight. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, he will crit on me with a 19. You're about to go flying. Mm. Dude, what do I do? I'm like looking at him like, he's getting beat up. I'm hearing him get beat up. My <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 2d6 plus 22. Oh my god. Plus, yeah, so 28. God. Oh, jeez. Oh, Shikes. 37 30. points of damage. Holy oh. crap. On recoil. That'll burn through my temporary hit points. Oh, oh, shit. Oh. Mm. You all right up there, buddy? <laughs> no, I am not all right. I am the opposite of all right. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to make I a wisdom. I don't care. You lit my roof on fire. <laughs> 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 I actually don't care. You, <laughs> you don't know it was me yet. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna make a wisdom saving throw or wisdom check for this this commander. Roll flat on the screen, yeah. Roll flat on the screen. Eleven. Oh man. Coin flip then. Ooh. Oh, okay. Some more, ne more nefarious things going on here that we don't know about. Mm -hmm. Heads. He knows that I am from the airship. Hmm. That they just took down. Tails. He doesn't. Uh-oh. Oh. Heads. He will axe and surge. Oh, no. God. No. I don't know what that means, but it sounds cool. 
gonna get another turn. <laughs> he gets a second again. second action to try to bully beat down me. First swing. No! Oh my gosh! No! This guy is another crit. Oh. Rolling so well. I don't know if we're gonna be able to help you, buddy. Oh man, I should have jumped off when I had the chance. <laughs> yeah. Join the the roof. The roof. <laughs> the roof is on fire. <laughs> this is not good. Oh my god. Oh. 36, I am down. 36? <gasps> no! I am, un I am unconscious. Jesus. He will take his second swing and I will lose <gasps> two of no. my death saving throws. Oh my god. <laughs> that. I was joking about a TPK, man. <laughs> He's gonna kill. He's gonna well, he's strong. He's Holy cow. Oh. Full recoil. Nobody's even up there to hear dialogue either. Mm, nope. We don't even know what's happening. I can hear the booms. My friend. Oh. <laughs> He's not leaving either. Oh, jeez. Umber, it is your turn. So, seeing Tesh get his ass kicked. Thank you. I, uh, I, I, you see, you see me turn and start to head that way, and then as the scene transpires up on the roof, you almost see this like uncharacteristic, like just turn of the head, as if almost I'm hearing or smelling or sensing something, and you see me immediately try to monk shit my way up the side of this onto the roof. So I want to see if I can try and uh, find some holes and nooks and crannies to try and climb up to the roof. Athletics check. Oh, are you sure it's not acrobatics? <laughs> <laughs> well, explain to me that you're going to do it acrobatics instead of trying to find holes to pull yourself up. <laughs> Yeah, you're right. How, you, how are you acrobatic? But I don't even see anything back there, right? That I can even do, so. Uh, use your imagination, how, how Peter. Roof? This would be a jump from a window seal with the acrobatics, trying to spin yourself up on top of the roof. Yeah, that, that sounds pretty cool. Yeah, I'll go to the window and I'll try to like jump and then spin and like try to like grab the ledge and like swing my way up. Cirque du Soleil roll incoming. <laughs> Fourteen. Fourteen. As you pull this maneuver off, trying to get up, oh, you can feel you just don't have quite of the ledge to try to flip yourself over. You need to make an athletics check to be able to pull oh, this God. off. Oh, let's go! Right? Oh, DC, right. DC 16. Whew. The same as the acrobatics was. You can get yourself up on the roof with your normal oh, movement. Uh, so that was like 10 feet, roughly. I have, I have plenty. I can, you know. So as I as I like swing and then grab and I, I hesitate for a moment and then I like kind of kick myself and I, I like swing the rest of the way up, roll and then kind of stand. Uh, I my eyes are immediately uh, drawn to recoil, and uh, I, I just look at the the lizard and say, "Hmm, perhaps you should try someone like me instead." And I will approach, and as I do, I'm just going to stretch my arm out to the left, uh, and you're going to see just kind of like the ever faintest dust, like coalesce over recoil as I cast Spare the Dying as a bonus action. And then I will engage 
directly with a lizard. Dang, here it goes. How much health does he have left? Can we check that? He, so on bad guys, I never let you guys know the exact amount. I say gotcha. they're bloodied when they're about halfway down. Gotcha. Oh, there's a fireball. That's cool. Uh, oh, it's the fire. Hell yeah. So <clears throat> I cast Spare the Dying and then I go, because uh, that's a bonus action. Um, now, did you need to as touch? I cast it. No, because as a cleric of the Grave Domain, it is at 30 feet. Let's go. Oh, nice. Because I am a all about life and death, y'all. So <laughs> I am all about that. So, uh, so I am cursed. I am currently stable. You are stable, but you are still unconscious at zero hit points or one hit point, but like you're still out. Okay. But you are stable. Give me a spell attack roll on this. You need to be above a 10. A spell attack roll, eh? Okay. Uh... <laughs> That's an eight. Um, I have, I have a D8 I will use. Uh, are we still under the blessed of the tavern? Do we get a D4 added on top of uh, what we're doing right now? You right. That's a good call. I totally forgot so about 15. our blessing of the tavern, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's why it's on the sheet. I'm like, I just realized that we're getting right now. This is the time to pull out everything that's in the notes. Oh, look, oh. we got a blessing of the tavern because this is Cletus' place. Let's go. Oh, Could have used that back there. Sorry. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. 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 I was focused right. in on the story, not about the technics. You will be able to keep your inspiration. Recoil is stable at one, unconscious. <sighs> and then uh, for my action, um, let me just make sure I can do this because because this is kind of cool. Uh, so as I as I reach my hand over to recoil uh, and then you see the dust kind of coalesce, uh, you see some of the like, I don't know, is it like oil that is, is spurting out? Like, what what does that look like? <laughs> <laughs> what does it look like when I'm busted open? It's just <laughs> yeah. there's just gears and wires and it, it's it's I run on ethanol. So there's <laughs> there's, oh. there's, there's some booze. Right on. <laughs> There's some okay, booze right. leaking out. Uh, I, Fair enough. Hopefully it doesn't get too close to the fire. Smell like. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then well, I will. It'll be tricky, but I will then uh, kind of like as I turn 95. my. Yeah, there we go. My arm kind of uh, coalesces, <laughs> and you see like this greenish, blackish, like vein snake up my arm, and then I turn and I just go to uppercut them, and as I do, I cast inflict wounds. Going for an inflict wounds uppercut. I'm all about yeah. this. It's pretty cool. So, <laughs> we will see though. Tiger uppercut. Tiger. <laughs> Tiger. Well, that was a ten to hit, so it's not going to do it. But no. Wow, that would have been a lot of necrotic damage. We're just having so much trouble with this guy. <laughs> this guy yeah. is Teflon right now. Yeah, for real. I'm gonna have like uh, a D8 good. and so left, DM but. Give me one second here. Oh yeah, I get a D4, but I don't think it's really gonna matter. Yeah. Rip. 11. Thank you, right. I have one, I have one no final D8 inspo. What was that? Where did you get that? You got one, it from me. Yeah. Yeah, I gave I gave you guys Bardic Inspiration at the very beginning of it. Literally burned them all yes. on you. Uh, is that a D8, right? Yeah. That's what I have written. Okay. Yep. And I'll... <laughs> no! Oh my gosh. 12! 
I am will not legend. hit. <laughs> and that'll be my turn. That's everything. And now I'm up here on this roof by myself with this guy. <laughs> nice. With the dead robot. Yep. Oh, looks like you have a penchant for your own death as well. I enjoy stripping every bit of flesh off of your rotting body. Death is inevitable, friend. It comes to us all. End of Ubber's turn. Big lizard. Uh, that the commander's riding on is going to bite at you, Umber. Chomp. Smack. Oh, man. 18. Still is hot. That'll hit. Five points of piercing damage. Second bite. 13. It misses. Let's go. Damn nice. <laughs> I'm trying to get used to how it does its turn order. <laughs> What's alive and what is dead. Okay, that is alive. Vess, it is your turn. All right. So to start, I am going to bonus action cast Shillelagh. Shillelagh. <laughs> Shillelagh. Shillelagh. <laughs> Shillelagh. <laughs> Shillelagh. <laughs> I believe that's it's a uh, an Irish word. Um, Shillelagh. Gaelic. Yes, Gaelic. Yes. Gaelic. <laughs> And I'm going to imbue that into my club, and I'm going to take my club and bonk this guy right in front of me. Yes. Uh, so I get to use my spell cast. I'm just going to roll a d20 on Foundry with the modifier here, which is plus five. I think Captain Robert did the same thing monster hunting with him. Mm-hmm. Oh, and <laughs> a natural 20. That'll hit. All right, let's go. D8 plus three. Oh. oh. Unfortunate. And then um, I'm going to use one of my, my action surge here. And do I do I see that the roof is on fire? Yeah, you can see the roof's on fire. Or at least I start to smell it at least. Um, what I'm going to I smell the smoke. Um, what I'm going to do is uh, with my second action here, I am going to. Where is that spell? Uh, call lightning. And the text here says a storm cloud appears. I like to think that a storm cloud also includes rain. Um, so as I'm, you know, I'm. You see Vess uh, beginning to. Um, she grabs some of her staff and so she's got like her, her her club in one hand but she grabs her staff and begins to uh say these incantations and the sky starts to get a little gray on t uh, above the roof and it's 60 feet so that's basically the whole roof so uh, it gets pretty gray yeah. up there. And what spell are you using? Uh, call lightning. Call lightning. And I'm going to call a bolt of lightning on this big boy on the roof. Let's go. Holy shit, that's awesome. And he has to make a dexterity saving throw, DC 13. All right. So there's Just rain. Just and to lightning. verify, it's raining right now on the fire, right? Yes, that's okay. my hope. 
Is that just DM? <laughs> oh gracious! Oh gracious! DM! <laughs> oh gracious! DM! <laughs> Does it begin to rain? <laughs> See how strong your ability to channel the weather is. <clears throat> DC 17, roll your spell attack. Okay, let's let's try it. Come on, come on. Guys. Come I, on. <laughs> do you have inspo? 14. I do. Uh, let's use that D6. Remember, you have your D4 to roll first from uh, the oh, Blessing yeah. of the Tavern. D4. All right, let's let's do it both. All right, that's a one. That's an Adam roll. Uh, and that's another Adam roll. <laughs> oh, my Adam. God. No. Oh, no. Adam rolls. You've cursed. <laughs> no. So, 15, 16. What was the DC? 17. <sighs> Damn it. Damn it. Did you use the inspo that I gave you as a D8? <gasps> oh, sh oh my God. Yes, I have a D8 inspiration. Let's go. And Let's go. Hey, hey you get all you need is a two. I right? just need. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Okay. Now. You cannot defeat me. <laughs> <laughs> I give up. I give up. <laughs> I'm gonna get another beer. I'll be right back. Oh, DC of 17. <laughs> DC 7 does that. But you can't use a. You can't use two inspirations. Damn. That was the other thing. So Damn. at least you get that D8 back. It was just nice to see if it would have hit, and it and it. It's three ones in a row. Damn. The rain <sighs> begins, but it is it is very it's light. Very light. Sprinkles. You'll have a chance oh. again in a second. Do I still get my uh, my lightning strike? You do get your lightning strike. Uh, okay. Absolutely. So that's going to be coming in in just a second. <laughs> All right. Dun, dun, dun. Now we have an epic battle on the roof. There's fire, there's rain, <laughs> the sky is <laughs> losing all the I expected today. this out of the Lizard King. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Jim Morrison is really messing with all of us right now. We are enacting a very country version of Beauty and the Beast. <laughs> <laughs> so oh, Adam, you can pick him. <laughs> so my uh, my GPU is handling things very well. My CPU is hating life. <laughs> oh. I have to turn the rain off. <laughs> oh. Oh. Well, I mean, she couldn't do it anyway. So <laughs> I feel anyway. True. Fine. All right, here's it's that. Not like the rain was doing anything anyway. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Deck save coming in with advantage. Mm -hmm. See. God, why is this guy roll so hot? <laughs> Damn. Twenty-two. Well, it'll be half damage. Are you serious? <laughs> Three D ten, and I rolled a six, so he takes half of six. Three points of lightning <laughs> damage. <laughs> what the? <laughs> this guy is Teflon. I'm telling you right now. However, he's coated Teflon. Oh my God. And those three points go to him instead of his lizard because of mounted, mounted combatant. I mean, he's wearing all metal, right? So, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that tickles. <laughs> nice try. Gotta rub it in. All right, guys. It'll be the top of the round with Cletus. When we get back, you guys take a quick break. Refill those beverages. Wow. Bum, bum, ba -da 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 -da. Yeah, sorry guys. about that, Robert. No, not at all. That's a hey, that's my uh, wife brought me a sandwich and chips, and I was like, dude, I don't want to eat on during the whole thing, but at the same time, I don't want it to go bad. I just want to eat it. <laughs> no, you're perfect, dude. We got you all set up just for that. <laughs> nice, thank you. Hell yeah, man. I felt like I was annoying you. I didn't want to be annoying. No, I just didn't see it over here. It was just out of my peripheral. <laughs> yeah, Let's go. God, that thing is destroying us right now. 
it i am rolling incredibly hot for the villain which is always a terrifying thing so <laughs> since we're off the stream right now um well they can still when i smell they can still still oh, hear they- on the stream Okay. Okay. When I when I smell fire, can I head head for the stair, the ladder? Oh, absolutely. Because we have the we have the ladder that goes up the roof. Oh, right? a- absolutely. Um, what options do I have? Can I carry a bucket of water? Like, what what all do I have outside of just the spells? Mm. Like, how does that work? I would say that you probably. Uh... I know where the water is and where the bucket is in my own bar. Like, is that a thing I can do or? (sighs) But the water would be back all the way across the bar. You're probably not going to be able to to have enough movement to get back to the bar and then up to the roof. Gotcha. It's Mm. It's a bad situation to be in. Yeah, it's bad. Yes, I have been hot for the villains, Aaliyah. It's been bad. Only thing I think I can do is just burn another heel on the roof at this point. And hope we can get this figured out. That's probably your 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 best. Phew. It is a mess right now. I got it bad so bad. I'm hot for villain. It was like, oh, okay, no problem. We're going to sweep the rest of this. And it was like, crit, crit, crit. Good God. He, literally four crits in a row between his hits that he had. It was two crit 19s and two 20s that backed it up. Ugh. Mm -mm. I thought I had a way where I could talk to the enemy and make it not want to hurt us. Like, I thought that was something that my character had. Yeah, you have uh, you have those abilities. Uh, The problem is you're this far in the combat. They will likely. Yeah, he's pretty pissed. Uh, What is your main (laughs) one that you can do? Oh, I do have interact with an object under actions and combat, so I could grab a thing of water, but I yeah, probably you... would have to wait till next turn to use it. Yeah, the problem is you're just too far away from it. You can totally interact with any any object around you. Uh-huh. Yeah, what I'll probably do is grab a bucket of water, head up to... Uh... Head over to this. The, yeah, I could. Oh, I'll do it. I'll figure it out. I think I got it. Like I said, your immediate is a heal. Yeah, which that, you can right. still do running to go get water. So it's going to be oh. it. Cletus, Latash. And then I'm just in stasis. Definitely not looking good right now. <laughs> no. Now, can I wake up from Spare the Dying, or am I completely at your your will? Uh, uh, you just become stable. So, I mean, that's up to you. You just you okay, just stabilize. It's, it's a uh, it'd be a nat nat twenty for me to like undertake or kick out and be like, <gasps> yeah, probably for well, sure. With the way you've been rolling tonight, go for it. <laughs> well, if I click on the commander and I roll for it, it'll give me that twenty. If I roll for myself, I'm just going to go down in flames. 
Do any of us have resurrect or anything? No. Is that not a thing? Mm. To resurrection? There, oh, no, you're very, very far one. off from that. Are you, the, Item H. Thank you, chat. The Hell first yeah. first thing would be revivify that someone would have, and uh, no one, I think, currently has it. No. So does I, that mean you're done for? No, 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 no. I'm stable right now. I'm screwed if I <laughs> fail three death saving throws. So when they hit me when I'm um when I'm un uh when I'm unconscious and I'm making saves, you have three of them. If they hit you when you're in that state, they can take two away. So if it weren't for Adam, I could have just got one shot and died. And been dead. So Adam is keeping me alive right now. So even if he swings twice at me, I'm just back at two death saving throws. Gotcha. But he's up there now. So the likelihood of uh, him swinging at me is much, much lower now. He's going to keep clawing at what human life is there. Yeah, I'm going to try and come up too. So we might try and keep him off. Ain't much. <laughs> Ain't much. How did this go so far? Like the tavern is on fire now. <laughs> I'm we were about doing dead. so well. Look, like, we were doing so week. well, and we then were, like, on fire last week. Now literally, we're on fire. <laughs> like, oh. <sighs> tonight is just cursed. <laughs> <laughs> curse stream. Yeah. <laughs> Straight up curse stream. All right, Cletus. I'm ready. The roof is on fire. <laughs> How would you like to but proceed? We but we do need that water. Um, I do want to proceed. Um, so I'm going to travel to the staircase that was used by Vess in the very beginning to get on the roof, which I believe would take me to right here. I believe that's where we showed the staircase previously, or the, the ladder. Mm -hmm. um, on the way there, I'm gonna grab the mop bucket. Um, I don't think I have the movement to get to the water and then get back. So I'm going to go ahead and turn and cast Cure Wounds on the roof. Just holding up, grabbing that beam brace. Mm -hmm. The smoke is just pouring in now. Fire erupting through the top of the roof. I'm going to try and save my roof from collapsing. Um, First, I want you to roll a D20. Oh, that's right. You wanted the 20. I forgot. See if you crit this bad boy. Oh, so close. your wounds you're going to add 11 points back on to that roof uh do we have i have any inspiration right now or does that not work with heals so no you can't have... no it doesn't add on to the uh doesn't add on to the, the number no okay cool so roof has 25 hit points back on it flames are still there as you strengthen this you can literally see the wood forming back into place where that building once was literally patching it with your own magic but the flames are still raging with a foot on that ladder that'll be the end of your turn Cletus yep lay tash Oh, considering I'm laying on my ass, this isn't the best place I would like to be. I will use um, half my movement to get myself up off my ass so I'm not laying prone right. anymore. And as I do that with my 
loot in front of me, I just strum one chord. And as those notes ring out from the sound hole of my guitar, they form this barrier around me using the Blade Ward cantrip. Basically, I'm resistant to bludgeoning, piercing, and slashing for this next turn. Um, and then while I'm doing that and sliding my guitar away, I'm grabbing my dagger. And I'm going to thrust it at the lizard folk that's in front of me. As those symbols come up from your loot. <laughs> Have you stood up yet? Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm okay. up. I, awesome. used, I used to have my Half movement, movement to get up. All right, go ahead. Take the swipe at him. He is bloodied. No! Oh, God. oh no, 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 no. I, wait, wait. I'm not done yet. I still have I still have my three. I still got my, still got my tavern bonus, which is the three. Eleven That's, still does not hit. And I and I have my inspiration. The check gave me. <laughs> Burn it at all to try I'm to get... Burned. I just want to kill him. <laughs> 18. Or no, let's see. Uh, so eight plus, you were at 11, 16. 16. You just get it by one. They're at 15. <sighs> oh, here's Randy God. I can do enough damage to just put him down. Oh, <laughs> oh, no. <my> God. <laughs> so unlucky. Three piercing damage oh, after my. all that. When you switch to your dagger, it doesn't always work out for you. It had three hit points left. (laughs) (laughs) I just clicked on it. I was like, oh, no. Comes out. Just thrust it right up under his jugular, stabbing it underneath his jaw, right into his brain. (laughs) Surprised the fact that he's dying at this point. (laughs) He pulls his dagger back out. (laughs) Oh, deep breath. You're like, oh, my God. DTD, let's go. 15 <laughs> feet of movement, Laytash. This, this bloody lizard just slumps over your way. Let's see, I've slid down the roof, got my ass kicked. I know recoil is up there and I just saw while I was laying on my ass, Umber run up there. Oh man, I think I need to use, what? what is my 15 feet of movement? I don't even know if I can get to a point of where I can see what's going on on the roof. I mean, I might as well. At this point, I'm, I'm just going to move myself to where I can try and see what's happening since there's nobody else on my side. What do you see? Uh, I'd have to roll general perception. I don't think I have a chance to do that right now. I mean, you can see that all hell's breaking loose up on the roof. Like you can, you've heard all of this going on up here. Uh, problem is I burnt everything I've got. I don't, I don't even have a bonus action left. I'm just trying to get to a point of where I can see. And then if I need to cast a spell, he's running to the outhouse. Yep. <laughs> Run into the <laughs> Jack. <laughs> well, shit. Jack. <laughs> Unconscious recoil needs a nat 20 to wake up. You can't throw a nat 20. Come on. No, oh, I was trying to mudcat you. Well, I don't, I don't, <laughs> I don't get mudcatted. I just throw them. <sighs> oh no! Took away my turn order. All right, into my turn, Garomesh. It is your turn. Save us all here, Matt. Save us all. All right. <laughs> so I'm going to climb up onto this shed. I assume it's a shed or a wood pile or something to get a better vantage point. What is that over here? Looks like a shed. <clears throat> Like yeah, it's, a it's, it's chicken coop kind of thing. Yeah, it's tiny. It's definitely not. Uh, 
you're not on the level but you standing like you can see you're, you standing is at like everyone else's legs height okay that's i just i just need something some sort of something <laughs> well and if you I look will... not to not to be the stickler but if you look at the shadows it's actually got a giant shadow as everything else okay it looks like a chicken coop <laughs> not to be that that uh, guy but it does have the same shadow of uh, size as the rest of the buildings and i will unload all of my attacks as well as an action surge of more attacks on the big bad guy that's killing everyone let's go baby let's see if this works and i am in melee with him Oh, oh. Whoa. That, <laughs> that's uh, a 91d4, baby. <laughs> All right, so that 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 macro didn't work. One d twenty and ninety four d four. Two hundred twenty three damage. When you can't right, kill let's... a boss, throw everything at him. <laughs> yeah, uh, heavy crossbow. Oh, use. Oh, Plus my d4. D4. Yeah. So, in 16, did 16 hit? 16 does not hit. You need that to roll that superior. D4. I did roll the D4, and then, but I will also throw a superiority die on top of it. 20 to hit. 20 will hit. <clears throat> All right, so that will be heavy crossbow, 10 points of piercing. And then extra attack, hand crossbow, 19 to hit. Plus a d4. 19 does not hit. Then but your d4, d4, it will hit. Okay. Nice. Nine points of piercing. You just give me your total when you're done. Okay. So. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's, okay. Bring it all up at the register. <clears throat> Ting, 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 ting. Oh, fuck off, man. Oh, my God. Another four. <laughs> and then. So it's 16. I know that doesn't hit, so I will throw a inspiration on that. Just D8. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> Barely made it. <laughs> Yeah, roll and smoke them if you got them, you know. Four. And then two more hand crossbows because of uh, uh, action surge. And as. No! Cock knocker. <laughs> <laughs> knocker. <laughs> those, both those shots as they just lock up and jam. Both of them? Yeah, you lose both. Okay. So, as a, a stand up and I, I take the, uh, it was a total of, let's see, where's my damage? Damage, 24 points of piercing damage, by the way. 24. Uh, so I, I stand, like, get up on the roof and I immediately get down in a, a half kneel tactical and I take the, the first shot with the heavy cross drop that and i take four shots with the 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 hand cross you're cutting out again by the way <clears throat> sorry i'm leaning away from my mic um i take four shots with my hand crossbows and as you see the first two go off you see the hand crossbow the something on it turns and automatically loads another two bolts but it jams on it Ugh. anything else for your turn I th think that's all I can do. Too bad those yeah. bolts going through the fire don't inflict fire damage. <laughs> <laughs> Not yet. But yeah, that's it. That's oh it for boy. me. Stupid ones. Yeah. It's been a night of stupid yeah. ones. <laughs> stupid ones. Oh no, Vest down here with the big boy lizards. Yep. 
I pulled this one into me too. <laughs> uh. <laughs> All right. It's gonna swing oh. its great club over at you. <laughs> These are a plus six to hit. Let's go. First one's gonna miss. That hits. That one's gonna connect. 1d8 plus four. gonna do nine points of bludgeoning damage <sighs> gonna try to toss you uh, another shield bash your way Ooh. just 14 hit that just hits uh. Uh. it's gonna do an additional seven points of piercing damage with the spike shield. You need to make a strength saving throw to see if you were still upright. 15. 15, you will succeed by holding your ground just barely. This lizard folk is going to back off of the front door, going around those steak knives, and it is gonna come for you, Vess. Oh boy, I'm in danger. <laughs> I'm in <laughs> danger. <laughs> yeah. That is. That. Dirty 20 will hit. Next strike. Does 15 hit? It does. Oh no. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm squishy. Oh Mom's no. My AC is. <sighs> Not good. All right, here's the uh, here's the shield strike as well. Shield strike will oh. hit as well. Oh my oh god. god. Okay, so we're going to do the first <clears throat> first two. That's going to be 2 d8 plus 8. You take 15 points of bludgeoning damage. Then another 10 points of piercing damage. Strength saving throw, Vess. All right. 16. Oh, let's go. Strong. Get it. Ooh. Get it, get it, get it, get it. As you are surrounded by these massive lizard men, probably pretty bloodied up at this point. Not looking good. End of their turns. Lizard commander up on top of the roof. Going for you, Umber. First oh, swing. Boy. Great weapon master. Plus eight. Coming in. Twenty one will hit. Second swing. Oh, 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 oh no crit yeah this is gonna be bad oh, wait no he rolled a 19 right yeah he crits not, on 19 not, no yeah. he rolled an 11 plus 8 oh yeah it's not a 19 roll Oh, let's go. Yeah, it was let's go. <laughs> let's go. I was like, wait a minute. No, that was an 11. Let's <laughs> I <was> go. Like, <laughs> I know you want to kill me, but like, come on. <laughs> I have so I many. go down anyway. I have so many different instance versions in front of me. I'm like, ah, which one is it? Ah. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> One, two, three, 
four D six plus thirty two. Plus thirty two. <laughs> two gr- two great weapon master shots. Plus he gets six points per each swing on his great sword, and then the four D six from the great sword swings. Jesus. Mm. Jeez. 45 points of slashing damage, Umber. Ow. (laughs) Umber, it is your turn. (laughs) As you are now bloodied. Is he alive? I was gonna say, oh, yeah. right there. Tim hit points. <laughs> I, <laughs> I am still alive. I am still. I am still swinging. Literally. Um. Okay. What do I do here? I am going to. Uh, yeah, I'm screwed. I'm going to try this again. I'm going to, I'm going to try. You're just going to see, like, me just, like, wipe some of the, like, blood and dirt and clay that all just seems to kind of mix together, mix together. That's, that is what makes up my skin. And I'm just going to, like, squeeze my hand and then once again, with another punch straight to the, to the face, inflict wounds, uh, do my best. So. Come on, baby. Oh my God, dude. I'm rolling horribly. But I got a D4 and a D8 from chat. I need to roll an eight. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Mm. Uh, all right. Then. Uh, Bonus action, uh, I'm just gonna try and punch him twice. Floria blows. <sighs> As the inflict, God, the inflict wounds would have done so much damage. Ugh. Yeah, what if? Level six, baby. One punch, 19, the D4 will make it hit, right? So that's seven. And then the second hit, well, that won't hit because that'll only be a 16. So he's going to take seven bludgeoning damage as I what, punch what him your, once. What was your initial roll? Uh, it was 19. And then if I add a D4, okay, it'll be yes. 20. Mm-hmm. Correct. Yeah. And then the second one was a 12 plus a D4. Let me check. Uh, and ch- uh, Are you still doing that? Because checking a D6 and a D8, are you still going where it just like levels up? Or can I spend both? can't spend both you can hold on to the inspirations but you can only use okay. one inspiration per turn around gotcha okay then uh, noted so i'll remove that uh and then yeah you'll just see me kind of like close my eyes and just say if it is my time i am ready And I will, I will step in front of Recoil. Recoil starts, but it's not my time, goddammit! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm definitely going down next turn. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I have a question real quick. Yes. Do you remember our conversation we had? This is out of character. Yeah, that conversation we had about Mage Hand, and I can make it do work for me or something oh, like that. Oh, absolutely. Can Abs- I make that go take the water up there? Yeah, you can totally send Mage Hand up with oh the bucket of water. All right, all right. I can do other things this turn. Good. Hundred <laughs> percent. So save me, Cletus. <laughs> Mage, Mage Hand, I will let you use your bonus action to send it out with the bucket of water and you'll still have your your action. Let's do it. Let's roll. All right. Where we're at in this shit show. Lizard is going to bite at you, Umber. 
<laughs> I forgot about the lizard. Oh my god, the lizard's gonna kill me. <laughs> now, will that suspend your cantrip on me? No. No, no, it's, I guess it's... It just happens. You're stabilized, right? Yeah. You still need to get healed to pop back up, but you're yeah. good. Unless they hit you and stuff, then... Yeah. Oh god. It's been fun. Thanks for having me, guys. Oh. Four okay. points. Are you still up? Still up. Let's go. Still Four up. points. Hey. We're still up. Last lizard bite. Come on, man. Come on. Yes. Oh. Yes. <laughs> Mine rocked nice. on that 20 so Ooh. hard. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Lashing out at you will miss on that second bite. Mm. Oh my god. That'll be the end of that up top. Vess, it is your turn. All right. <laughs> so, I got these two guys in front of me. Um, I am going to... Sorry, Cleotus, about your front porch. Uh... Oh, no. Oh, no. He apologizes oh, no. ahead of time. <laughs> <laughs> Look at his face. He's like, what? <laughs> I'm so sorry. So I'm not going to do... I have two different earth-shattering spells. And this one is the lesser of the two. Listen, so don't Bill, worry. <laughs> Bill, listen, Bill's rocking chair is right next to you. Can you <laughs> picture Bill's rocking chair? Okay? I will try to miss Bill's rocking chair. <laughs> and uh, Bell sniper for that one. <laughs> um, I'm going to cast Earth Tremor at oh. second level. Um, so each creature must make a dex saving throw. Deck saving throw from the creatures uh, coming in. 13. 13. All right. What do they got? Come on, Rollo. <laughs> <laughs> All right. These guys got plus twos. Oh, let's go. Nice. 11. That'll fail. Second one. Yes. Let's go. Both of those are going to fail. Awesome. So at second level, they take 2d6. So let me just roll this twice. So they take f five bludgeoning damage, uh, but they do get knocked prone. Oh, good deal. That's huge for you. Yes. Get you a chance to get out of there at least. And I'm gonna get out of there. <laughs> I'm gonna use my movement to run around to the yeah. Uh, probably. Let me just see. Five. Actually, can I move myself? No. Five, ten, fifteen. Ooh, that's not. The, that's the wrong one. Uh. Uh. Yeah. I'm gonna try to run around to the other side of the building. Okay. So you're gonna take one step mm. back. Only one attack of opportunity that you have to miss out on here. Okay. And it has disadvantage because it's kind of flail on the ground <laughs> trying yep. to take this swipe at you. All right. First one. 16, 14. Does 14 hit? <clears throat> that does not hit. Let's go. You'll be able to get out of there. <sighs> Just barely. Way to go, Vess. Way to go. All right. You should be able to move yourself. I I cannot. I'm clicking on me. Uh ah, there we go. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. Getting the hell out of dodge. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Can't say I blame you. Yeah. All 
All right. End of your turn. I'm just waiting. I'm just waiting for when Gator Form's coming. <laughs> <laughs> Soon. <laughs> they call me Gator Salad. <laughs> you, got me. you got the Gator. Oh. Oh, oh, I have to roll fire damage first before Cletus's turn because that's on recoils. Um, 2d8. I mean, I mean, we can just forget about it. I mean, never... <laughs> 10 points. Roof sitting at 11 points before structural failure bonus action cletus all right cletus kind of like reaches up with his hand and puts his two fingers in his mouth and just blows this ear shrieking whistle and from the back of the tavern you just see this hand jump up on the counter and it's wearing like a chef's hat and it just comes to <laughs> speed running across the room <laughs> And he's like, get a bucket and get up there. <laughs> I got I got a lot of things, but unfortunately I don't have the chef's hat. <laughs> and it just grabs the bucket, fills it up with water, and starts hopping up the steps to the ladder. Thing. The Put out the fire on just the roof, please. <laughs> pours water all over the fire and hopes that it helps. Save the tap. <laughs> All right. Five gallon bucket. Roll two D10s. The way it's been going tonight, this ain't going to do nothing. One on D10. Two ones back to back. Assuming that's it. Okay, here we go. Those are good. Those are the middle on both point. Let's, Let's go. go. 12 points. That's enough to take care of one of the D8s on that fire. Nice. You got it halfway out now. Hmm. I mean, it, at this point, it's me doing it, right? It's either me do it or do something else, right? What's that? I'm trying to think if I can actually help with the fire myself. You just have to I think. think I have to think creatively. Yeah. Um, I mean, my most important thing, I know the roof may end up collapsing at this point. My most important thing is getting to my team. Um, Umber is pretty important to me. So I'm going to go ahead and head up the ladder. All uh, right. With nothing in Cletus, for the first time, you're going to be up on the roof. You're going to see the fire halfway put out, your mage hand doing work, recoil down and unconscious, umber bleeding next to the side of this massive scaled champion. I'm going to cast Cure Wounds on umber. Cure wounds, you will have to be to touch Umber. So you have to use the rest of your movement to get over there. Oh god, that puts me in danger. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta commit. Welcome. Gotta, gotta commit. commit. <laughs> I slide in behind the chimney out of range of damage. <laughs> I can reach around enough to touch. I heard you were good at the reach around. <laughs> I am good at reach around. That's one thing I am known for here. In the Umber feels a little tickle. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, here we go. Going for the 20. Recoil online. <laughs> Not going to me. Going to Umber. Um, that's the crit, right? The 20? Mm -hmm. Yep. Then... Oh. 
11. Looks like 11. 11 points of I'll healing back. So that keeps him in a safe place right now. Um, I do have a second option, correct? A, um, no, you've used action, bonus action. Oh, okay. I used them both. All right. We're good. Used all the movement to get up there. Let's go. Laytash, it is your turn. So where I'm at, can I see El Capitan of uh, the lizard guys? I mean, I'm kind of a, I'm in a weird place right now. <laughs> it's it, you can just like barely see him. You can, like a couple more steps back, and you can probably get a, a, a better idea of what's going on. And that's what I'm gonna do. I'm, I'll move a couple of steps back so I can get a, a better view of what's going on in the room. You can I see, you can see recoil splayed out, unconscious, bloody, bloody Umber, Cletus reaching around the chimney, and that scaled champion up top doing work. <laughs> I think I know exactly what I need to do here. Laytash, the blood still on his blade. shucks it off into his hand and licks it and when he does his eyes start to glow in this haunting purple blue light as he locks on to what he can see of this captain psionically sends this stream of you dirty mother lizard licking <laughs> As he gets vicious mockery on him. <laughs> My favorite spell ever. My favorite. <laughs> He's gonna need a whiz fourteen to get out of this one. All right. Tell us how you really feel. <laughs> <laughs> All right. D twenty plus four coming in. Straight up, no no advantage on this guy. You no. gotta be. Oh, oh, oh my god. These uh, well, twenty one uh, he, will succeed. He's not gonna have disadvantage, and he's gonna take half of. Uh, they, they, hey, I did another three point psychic damage to him. So, no, it takes you know. no damage on that cantrip. It just fails. All right. Because it's a cantrip. Uh, if it was a spell, it would take half. Yeah, it doesn't say anything about not succeeding, so you're good. All right. Cantrip well. burned. Movement burned. Cantrip burned. Uh, I guess I'm going to uh, you know, <laughs> stay right <laughs> You gonna play us a, a death narco Corrado back over there? <laughs> you know, I, for old I, Mexico's I, sake. Seriously, at this at this point, since I have tried to cast Thunder Wave on this man <laughs> and vicious mockery, and nothing is touching him, I'm just gonna sit down Indian style and <sighs> start to pick a bard tune. <laughs> just fucking! I don't know what I can do to kill this man. <laughs> Typical Latash. Frustration in a musician is the worst thing ever. This is killing my creativity. <sighs> All right. Let's see if I can pop up on this roll. Come on, give me a 20, man. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> oh my God. Let's go. Nat 20. What? what? I'm not dead yet. Just sitting up. Oh my God. Smoke him if you got him. 
<laughs> What's the worst thing that I can do right now? <laughs> Get him off the roof for one. <laughs> yeah. Can you knock him back somehow? Because if you can get him on the ground, then uh, we can do some damage down there. Cast Windows <laughs> Update. <laughs> Critical failure. <laughs> All right. I'm going to flip the switch on my arcane cannon. It's going to start spinning up. I'm going to cast Thunder Wave at it. Con save 15. <laughs> Did somebody just put that on there? What? <laughs> how did you, how did that happen? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you guys don't see it. That's no. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a giant skull there now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that doesn't mean good things. <laughs> Ominous. Uh. Okay. <laughs> I can't access it because it's got its giant skull over it. Here we go. All right. Mounted combatant. So this goes off of his constitution. One D twenty plus six coming in. My DC is fifteen. Here it goes. Come on, baby. Come on. You're all we got. <laughs> I don't know what oh, I did, no. but I just caused the zoom in. Show. <laughs> yeah, I did it. My camera moves to it. Epic. Yeah. Epic. You know, you're bringing us in. You're drawing us in. You're drawing us in over here. Oh my god. Just add it. It seems like I'm adding drama chat, but it's really just me not knowing how to work this VTT. <laughs> this works. Yes! Yes! Oh, nice. 13! <laughs> oh, let's go. This thunder wave is just gonna emit. They're gonna go 10 feet back. Gonna have to make a strength saving throw to be able to oh. hold on to this roof. Big lizard. Plus four on this strength saving throw. This will be a DC 16 like it has been for the rest of you guys. No! Ah! Let's go! Oh, nice. nice. We just missed it. Now we're getting some rolls. Oh. <sighs> they are going to fall down, hit prone down here. They're going to take an additional 2d6, both of them. Thunder wave damage. Oh, yeah. I get an additional d8. <laughs> Hell and yeah! Bar inspiration. Don't forget the bar inspiration. Mm. Uh, since I didn't roll to attack, I haven't been able to use the uh, the bar bar inspo. Damn! Did I only do thirteen points with forty eight? Brutal. Double sixes. Double sixes, though. We'll take it. It's going to be twenty five points of damage. Commander is bloodied. How's this mount doing? <laughs> we'll look at the mount now. Mount is in rough shape. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Ugh. As I'm going to just... Uh, 
peel myself back up. That's going to consume my movement. I'm just going to hoist myself up on the chimney. I'll take care of you, buddy. Just give me a minute. Don't worry. I'm planning on taking care of both of us. Oh, hold on. There's three of us up here. Just give me a second. Bonus action. When you're within 10 feet, I'm going to flip the flip the switch on my gun one more time. This will be the first time my radiant blast gets to go out for healing. <laughs> oh shit, you got heals? Healing cannon. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Let's do it. Let's go. So anybody that's within 10 feet takes this actual blast. I don't even I'm, need it. Oh yeah, you're fine, but uh I'm boy. fine, I'm cool. But yeah. No crit heal. We get two D A plus. Where is this bad boy? The integrated protection. Oh, does it hit the roof? The heel? Mm -hmm. Yes, it does. Yes. I just saw a bunch of dice, but it's not mine. <laughs> Click the wrong thing. <laughs> I was like, wow, that's a lot more than 2d8. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'll take it. There it is. Okay, plus four. Sweet. Boom. Let's go 12 points back for Umber, Recoil, and the roof. Yeah, baby. That's gonna reinforce the roof. It's gonna be back in I see good the green shape. Stuff like going through the roof and like bringing it back together. And I'm just like, <sighs> not so much worried about you guys, just the roof. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be worried about my baby too. <laughs> All right, 12 points back to myself. Boom. Oh, oh no, like it's old timer said your cannon just blows bubbles of hearts. <laughs> how do you, bloop, bloop, bloop. how do you do, how do you not die on your D&D uh, &D Beyond? I always have this trouble. How do you come out of death? Uh, click on it, heal yourself, right? Yeah, just, just give yourself, give yourself a point of healing. Heal. Okay, it was the yeah. it was. I didn't do the apply changes. There we go. Sweet. All right. Let's go. Tides are turning. Nice. It's coming back now. <sighs> Into recoil's turn, Garamesh. It is your turn. All Kill right. them all. <clears throat> all right. Seeing. Uh... Mr. Lizard Boy jump off the roof now. I'm going to jump off my awesome chicken coop. Actually, uh, I don't think you want to do that. Uh, Cause you'll have advantage from aerial position. Ooh, I, okay. I think you just are able to see them down yeah, over here. You can see here. right through that corner there. Okay. Yeah, I ignore all cover, so. I think up to shooter. three quarters. Yeah, up to three quarters cover. You can just see them down, Garamesh. Elevated need... since they are prone, you have advantage. All right. Oh, I didn't even think about that. So I will take sharp shooter. Sh sharp remember, shooter. The remember the mount is almost dead too. Oh, I, I'm only going for one. <laughs> 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 Do I have a, did I do the sharpshooter? Yeah, I did. All right. So. That is, why is it rolling the wrong one? <laughs> Join. Oh, 1d10 plus 14. I like that one. Join oh, the party. Why. Oh, that's my damage. That's why. That's why. 
makes you feel any better my middle mouse wheel just went out for a little bit just a second ago so i had to start <laughs> manually scrolling for some odd reason what a day <laughs> what a day at the what office a what a day at the office gonna have to get you a new mouse now <laughs> no it just needs to like run for there about three hours not streaming <laughs> to wake it up so 16 doesn't hit 16 does not hit we'll roll that let's get that four <sighs> no oh, man. 17 oh. 17 do you have any inspo left Oh, I have things, my friend. I have things. <laughs> I will roll a superiority die on top of that. Where's my superiority? He will make it hit. <laughs> yeah, he will. Yeah. Yes! yes! He will. Let's go! Nice! All right, let's make sure this macro is correct. He threw with yeah. advantage. They were both 16s. Oh, let's go! So 23 points of piercing on the first hit. Oh, and then... damn. Yeah, we're oh. going to see his build come out strong here in a second. Throw two hand crossbows that way as well. Ah, come on, man. <laughs> Jeez. So, hey, don't uh, forget, you got a D4 on each one of those. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. So <laughs> let, let him go, guys. He'll get through his turn. 15. Cannot use superiority anymore, but I can use the old inspo. The old inspo. So, 15. So 18 for both. 18 will not hit. Fuck. Hmm. Which one do I want? Which Wait, one you, I want? you rolled an 18 on one of your attacks, right? Right, but I'm the 11, I was applying the 4 and the... Oh, so I do get another D4 on that one attack. Yeah, I was going to so, say... Oh, let's go! Let's so go! Yes, yeah. Hey, I was, one say, I was more. like, you rolled an 18 on one. I was Ooh, like, actually, you got a D4. Does a, does a 19 hit? 19 does not hit. Okay, then we're, mm. then, then we're fine. Uh, uh, boop. So another six points of piercing. 23 plus six or 29 points of piercing. And I used an inspiration card, so I can't burn another. That's me. End of Garamesh's turn. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> oh no, Vest. Yep. Those big That's lizard true. folk are coming for you. Yep. Didn't run quite far enough. I only have, yeah, 30. Hey, but they moved halfway to get there because they had to stand up. <laughs> but, <you know. laughs> That's right, because they were it on didn't their ass. Mean anything. Uh, you were the only thing they could get to, otherwise, one of them would have went to um, Garamesh. I'm going to use, uh, I believe I can use this protection, which I think gives them a disadvantage. Or, hold on, let me double check what that does. Using uh, the protection pro stream loot card? Yes. One okay. of the cards uh, to disadvantage on their attack. Now, that one is for player can use the reaction to pose disadvantage on an attack within five feet other than other. on themselves. Unfortunate. <laughs> oh, well. well, I'll go. I'll yes, just I'll just die then. God. What a good name. So she was going to be here for arc one. And what, that, what we really meant was like one episode. And then arc one episode. Yes, I'll die. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I'm gonna die. <laughs> oh, no! 17 I'm hits! In danger. <laughs> yep, that hits. Five points oh, of okay, bludgeoning okay. damage. All right. Okay, still rolling, still rolling. <laughs> still... All right, all right. Oh, second that club misses. shot will miss. Shield spike. <sighs> Oh, will hit. 
You need to make that strength saving throw. Oh God, it does 12 points of piercing. So, I go down, but I am half -orc a half-orc. <laughs> so yes! I never keep me down. <laughs> You're never gonna keep me down. <laughs> <laughs> you are now laying prone with one HP. Yep. Oh boy. Advantage club shots coming in. There's more. There's more. That was just one. That was just that one. Was just one. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's a weird roll. Uh... That shot will connect. 17. Yeah, that's on. You will go unconscious. Yep. Shit. You will lose two death saving throws. as they swing their club for the second time. There is only one person with a reaction that can stop this shield spike, and that is you, Garamesh. This would involve you using a hero point and I will subtract your damage roll if you hit from their attack. That's at you, Tim, if you didn't. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I was just paying attention, attention to chat. <laughs> Say that again, thank you. <laughs> so, chat. you are the only person right now that has the chance to be able to impose disadvantage on this. Mm -hmm. You'll have to use your hero point to do so. If you hit, it will subtract your damage from their attack with their shield. I will absolutely do that. Otherwise, Vess will die. All right. Now, with you being prone, you're in luck that this is a disadvantage trying to lean over and literally have to almost put a knee on the back of this shield. So this is with disadvantage. The worst of 1D 20 plus six coming in. With an eight, you don't even have to use your hero point, Garamesh. Yes. All they needed was a 10 with your lifeless body, but an eight just awkwardly doesn't know how to finish you off with this shield as the spike goes in right next to you. end of their turn Jesus mm. 
that commander. They are going to get up. Get on their mount. Wisdom roll. It's pretty low. And it is going to dash towards you, Garamesh. One, two, three, four. Let's go, Cletus. It goes past your steak knives. Roll hey, damage. Yeah, hey, the yeah, steak yeah, knives. Yeah, the steak knives. <laughs> steak knives are still working, boys. Uh, that was the plan the ten. whole time. <laughs> Watch the steak knives finish him off. <laughs> oh, dude, I would love the steak knives to finish the mount off. Yeah. So just keep go sliding just into the gravel. Yeah. All right, so do I get inspiration with this for the tavern? Yeah, uh, no, because it's just damage. You're just rolling damage on it. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> it's pretty good. Nice. Okay. Six, eight, nine. Oh my god, it almost kills. One hit point left. Is oh that mount <laughs> limps forward? <laughs> it's less like. <laughs> a monster running in monster hunter oh no <laughs> no 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 it gets it i hadn't added in the damage from uh 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 the, the last piece of its fall let's go your steak knives <laughs> yeah oh, it comes off of the mount <laughs> will completely stop <laughs> He's gonna fall back down prone over here as that massive lizard <laughs> slumps down. Yeah, Describe man. the demise of that big lizard as it goes through your steak knives. Oh, just getting sliced up by these very serrated, horribly <laughs> rusted. <laughs> ever had. Just slicing him up. Tetanus is just filling his blood. <laughs> 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 and he just falls to pieces in a is, pool of blood as this commander falls down not too far from uh old 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 bill and mcdermott's cracker barrel rocking chairs <laughs> damn it not bill's rocking chair <laughs> <laughs> You can hear Bill inside. God damn it. <laughs> that commander begins barking out orders to the other large lizard men. That's going to be the end of its turn. It's back prone again. <laughs> Umber, it is your turn. Let's go, Umber. This is so tough because you're so far away from me. Remember, you just have to be able to see it, right? Yeah, but I mean, she's right on the edge. So I had to be all the way up on the edge to see her. Well, the good news is there's a little bit of pitch <laughs> that's right there in the middle. You see that, how it goes? Like up? Mm-hmm. Let me see what I can do. But knowing that Vess is over there, in that spot I will allow you to get up on that ridge and then roll a perception check yeah because I can easily see the big guy down there but her is the one that's tricky so oh so I'll go to like here is that what you're saying yeah and then roll the perception check Oh, 
Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know where uh, she's at. You can see the big lizard. You can see one of the BFGs. Just the, a little bit of the top of their head. I will, uh, I will run over there and I will look. And then I'll just say to myself, she is the lore keeper. Interesting. And then I will turn to look down at the big lizard down there. Tell me, friend, do you hear that? The bell tolls. It's your time. And I will cast uh, Toll the Dead. Ooh. So he has to make a wisdom save 13. <laughs> Hell yeah. That's well, a Timothy's favorite right there. <laughs> D20 plus four coming in. Come on, you little shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Nice. All right. Seven. All right. So he fails. So he takes. Ten necrotic damage. Ten necrotic damage. He is looking rough. Oh, damn it. I was hoping that would be enough. <laughs> as uh, as I say that, and then he would hear this, like, bell start tolling, almost as if the Grim Reaper was watching him. Um, that's all I can do. I mean, that's everything. I guess I'll, I'll try. I mean, I'll... I'll just move the rest of my my remainder like this way, I guess. I'll get to like right there, and then that'll be my turn. I tried. It's okay. You did your best. You did. <laughs> Thank. That lizard is gone. Yep, which means <laughs> steak knife yes. death. <laughs> Bloody steak, steak knife. Roll that death save. Death saving throw. Legitimate Aka. life or death roll. Needs a ten or above. Let's go! Oh yes. Let's go! Oh yes. <laughs> One success. Oh. Holy shit. Holy shit. My heart. Oh. Mm. I was I like, was oh my. And... Is Tracy oh. only going to get to make two episodes? <laughs> <laughs> I was like thinking about my second character already. <laughs> 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 I, 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 I think you going to be an elf. I, an elf. I have my Valinor elf ready to go. <laughs> so, you know. <laughs> oh. oh, God. <sighs> Cletus, it is your turn. Can I send my hand back to work? Yeah. I'm going to whistle get for him it. again. I do the high pitch whistle and I'm going to yell for him. Get down there and get some more water. He's going to go. run down, grab water, put out the remainder of the fire. It'll be able attempt to, to. It'll go down. It'll get the water. It'll have the water for next turn. Uh, okay. The damage that's on there is only the one one d eight from my flamethrower that was on my turn. Let's go! It's only two points. Right. It'll be able to handle uh, next turn putting that fire out with ease. All right, that's your bonus action, full action left and movement. I'm gonna I'm gonna Eldritch Blast the big boy. All right, you'll need to get up on the pitch of the roof. Um, I, can I just go down towards the bottom? Yeah, I forgot. You got all your okay. movement, so you can just you can just yeah. get down over by that side. Now you have elevated position. They're laying prone. Advantage on both of these Eldric blasts. So I start with a D twenty. Yep, you get to roll two D twenties on this bad boy. Roll that sucker again. These are plus six to hit. 22 Ooh. will hit on the first. Go ahead and roll the hit again. Uh, roll another d20. Yeah, roll another d20. Nine. Need something higher. Oh, yeah. Let's go, Chris. That's what I'm talking oh, 
talking about? <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Get crit. You get to roll two d tens plus ten damage. Let's go. Let's go. I have inspiration too, right? The the tavern. Since those, it's my turn. Uh those are just uh those are just to hit. Oh, okay, gotcha. <laughs> to not add to the damage. Gotcha. We hit it though. Okay. All right. 19 points of damage. Let me see if it's going to be enough. With two points to spare. Cletus Buford. Describe their demise. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I just reach back and scream with all the pain and agony of watching my friends drop to the ground watching the pain from everyone around me and the damage to my tavern that this man has caused this, this creature has caused me i just sling the most nastiest elders blast into his face and just watch his face explode everywhere all over the tavern we won't stop as his body just explodes as you describe hunks of it going all over Bill's rocking chair. <laughs> Got the Bill's chair. <laughs> Poor Bill. He ain't gonna be able to use that for a month. <sighs> I found enough to make a belt out of. I'm happy. <laughs> Let's go. End of Cletus's turn. There we go. <laughs> Laytash with your guitar. <laughs> <laughs> I saw the lizard guy go that way, so I'm gonna go that way too. But um, I'm gonna go on the back side of the house, so I'm gonna use I'm gonna use my dash, and I'm just gonna get there as quick as I can. You can see Vess. I can. Yeah, there's right there on the corner. Remember, you're seeing more shadow up there at the very top. Oh, uh, no, right there. No, you don't. You, you, it would, well, here, I'm going to let you roll a perception because that's the roof. Perception. It, it'll be hard. DC 18. Oof. And you, you, you know could what? potentially see I'll, her. I'll, I'm going to take that perception. Remember, I got that, that uh, tavern inspiration. Come on, let me see her. Let me see her. That's going to make all the difference <gasps> in this roll. Oh! oh, yeah. 26. Let's yeah. go. There's I, all our rolls right here. I'm, I'm burning a hero point to get me the rest of the distance because I can see that she's laying down. Do you have a healing word? I have uh, I have cure wounds. I don't have a healing word. Everything is touch. All right. Hero point. Or yeah, actually, I'm, you can I'm, just take your point of exhaustion. Remember to dash. You don't have to take hero point. You can uh, just take the one point of exhaustion and dash. Making my way over to the other side to her. Just like Cletus. It's a bardic thing. The reach around. The reach around, <laughs> baby. With cure wounds. Woo. Uh, I really hope I never have to be cured in this way. <laughs> <laughs> oh. We got oh. a giant cannon and a reach. Take 15 points. Bless. Nice. You. Oh, that is a lot of healing. Whew. I gotta grab that point of exhaustion. Swear to God, Recoil, you better, you better come over and. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, anything else for oh, your yeah. turn, Latash? Uh, no. I since I don't get a cantrip, I can't put up my blade ward. I, I don't have any other bonus actions. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm good. 
Recoil. Recoil, recoil. <laughs> is going to flip the Power switch up. on his cannon back to flame. Let's go! Listen, we've been here before, Recoil. <laughs> Thought we said we were gonna do this again! <laughs> we weren't doing this anymore! I look over at Cletus. This time I'm not gonna miss. Yeah, baby. Point that cannon back down at the two lizards. They gotta make DC 15 deck saving throws. They have a plus two. Too bad you don't have advantage for being elevated. Damn. <laughs> Let's go! They will <laughs> fail. Oh, come on, man. Cook them. Cook these babies. We're gonna have a barbecue later. Lizard Q, baby. Oh, when I Eldritch Blast, didn't that shut off the uh, the steak knives? No, Cantrip. No, it wasn't concentration. Oh, okay. Gotcha. One concentration, so it won't knock it out. I'm looking to see if I get to add my D8. Oh, no, I'm looking at your sheet. No wonder I don't see it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking over at Cletus, and I'm like, I don't see, my, I don't see the thing. <laughs> oh, we're going to have so much lizard meat next week. <laughs> Come up with some new recipes. Lizard dango on the, on the, on the menu. <laughs> lizard on a Barbie. Lizard play. Got a lizard, lizard gumbo. Lizard gumbo. <laughs> lizard potatoes. <laughs> hey, you know what? Lizard and potatoes with onions ain't a bad thing. Mm, lizard and potatoes. Lizard ale. Wait. <laughs> Gator and potatoes, man. Giant sign I put up the hill. Lizard barbecue this week only. <laughs> <laughs> Special catch. All right. This sucker is just going to get us here. We got two D8s coming in. Come on, baby. Roll hot. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. One lizard goes down. Woo. Next lizard is messed up. They are on death's door on fire. I'm going to flip that switch back and I'm going to shoot down your way, Vess. Don't get my crit, but it don't matter. We're doing 3D, no, just 2D8. <laughs> Plus four, Laytash, you will also get to be the beneficiary of my heel cannon. Whoop, whoop. 15 wow. points back. Another 15. Yeah. Nice. I feel good. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Garamesh, one big lizard on fire in front of you. Just take a big old hawk and just spit. <laughs> <laughs> Slow motion. Boom! Right off the side of him. All right. I'll just unload. Uh, we'll do sharpshooter on the first one. I would just scream bloody murder at this point. <laughs> oh, yeah. He's dead. Let's go <laughs> with sharpshooter. No reason to roll. You'll be able to do it. Describe right. their demise with your last arrow. So um, I just do the 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 John Woo movie. You know the with the the flowing cape and the doves and the everything. And I just <laughs> slowly walk towards him and just unload everything I have. And once I get. Once I get all the way up to him, um, you see me drop all the crossbows and I take out a long, um, basically a long curved knife that kind of flows along my forearm and I just open his throat and then give him like the up and in the end of the jaw as well, just to give him the. 
Going full Mortal oh. Kombat. <laughs> right? Finish him. Finish him. <laughs> Fatality. Unfortunately, the doves are the small Cornish game hens <laughs> that were inside <laughs> of Cletus's coop there. Yes. You just yes. you just let let out Tuesday night's dinner. <laughs> it's the, the most like redneck John Woo movie ever. <laughs> good, good thing we got lizard for the menu. <laughs> As you guys stare out now, coming incredibly close to death, but hanging on by a thread. Mm. Cletus's tavern just getting its much needed last bucket from his mage hand up over the top thanks buddy fire out and thanks to a couple of very very timely rolls Vessin recoil conscious. We're just going to let that camera pan out on the smoke in the bodies of these lizard folk. We will pick up with the aftermath next week. Yes. Ooh. What a night. Holy cow. <laughs> wow. I was I not expecting tonight to go like that. I was not expecting that at all. I thought we would be done in 30 to 40 minutes. That was yeah. <laughs> quite the fight. Dice had a different plan. That they did. <laughs> Whew. That got hot. That yeah. freaking the night the steak knives at the end though that save holy shit <laughs> steak knives that was coming so in awesome. oh. that was, that was MVP. awesome yeah <laughs> it, 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 it rolled perfect because it was just four so i rolled wisdom on him he was just going to be pissed that he got hit by these arrows it was just going to come and waylay so not concentrating not remembering what happened before just in a dead sprint towards garamesh and the steak knives take out his ride and then perfect there for you to kill him on top of the roof with a crit. Oh, yeah. That was so, so awesome. I can't believe that I got a crit to stand up to be able to thunder away. I know. Yeah. That was clutch. That was clutch. Oh. Now I have to commission Recoil to fix the roof next week. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, he is a builder. Uh, you're, 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 in, you're, in, you're in good hands with the artificer. Building stream next week. All right. <laughs> yep. Dude, that building was wild. Stream. I was not expecting any of that. I thought we were going to lose Vast's character and get. I thought. To I. I was Fifty-fifty chance I could have died right there. No, Luckily, no. it was a shield bash, which was their third attack. So it's like, okay, you got to like awkwardly lean with like this spike. Okay, disadvantage on this. <laughs> Didn't even need Garamesh's hero point to try yeah. to to try to block it. And then that death save, yeah, it was like, oof. Because, like, we're out in the so west. What puts, what puts her at ten and you at twenty, though? What is the what's the cause of that? I don't know how that whole thing works. Like she got a she needed a ten, but you needed a twenty. Oh, okay. Oh, so because you were unconscious. So she needed uh, in death saving throws, you need a ten or above to make a uh, to make a success. Because the spell that Adam put on me, technically I wasn't dying, didn't need to make saves anymore, but I wasn't conscious. So I set. As myself, I said, you're going to need a nat 20 to be able to wake up or wow. X amount of rounds. So what I was you doing, I had two de- I had two death saving throws on me. So I was going to be like, okay, two rounds before you can even wake up unless I roll a nat 20. And I rolled the nat 20, which I'd set. And that's when he leaned up and turned the gun on and just was like <laughs> Terminator <laughs> style. <laughs> And then also when you roll death to, death saves, if you roll a one, it's two losses. If you roll a 20, you wake up. Yeah, if you roll a 20, you wake up. Yeah. So there's a good precedent for that. 
Man, Gino we needed never that. Took a single point of damage that entire fight. <laughs> <laughs> Not one point of damage. Wow. I felt so bad too. Like character wise, he's just like, oh, why is everybody getting messed up so bad? <laughs> <laughs> I need to help. Well, it, it started like, great, the <laughs> and then it then it went south yeah. real quick. Yeah, it real did. fast. And I, you know, I'm still the, you know, I'm still the main component of tossing health out. So here I go again at the beginning of my episodes, <laughs> getting critting on myself, and I'm like, no! I was like, Recoil's gonna get me killed. When you knocked the lizard commander down, he went towards Tim instead of me. <laughs> went, that would have been a whole nother situation where I, you'd had two dead people on one, each side of the building. If just sitting cross-legged with your guitar and you see yeah. just strum at once, like, uh... Oh, oh, Everybody! <laughs> but if Recoil... Out his face. If Recoil had gotten off the roof, probably would have lost the tavern. Because he would have had its had its way up there with the fire and just made it worse mm. yeah. in his mind. So we got, <laughs> it almost cost everything, but we got out of there. Barely, barely. Damn it, Cletus, you gotta keep your tab. <laughs> 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 almost cost us a couple of uh, lives, but you, you kept your tab. Right 70s montage music rebuild. <laughs> yeah, <it is. laughs> Wiping the counter, somebody's knocking the window in. <laughs> At the outpost. <laughs> oh it's man, like the, it's like the move the truck repair thing, except for it's like move the lizards. Like all the townsfolk <laughs> when it's done are just like move those lizards, oh. and they just like oh, it's a new tavern. So many oh. town folk that are gonna come out and look at all these lizards here when the we pick carnage. up next week. Yeah. I'm excited to get back to the RP. Oh yeah. Yeah. Very, very much so. Thank you for everyone hanging in with us with uh, our technical difficulties on start. I told you we get a good session. I just didn't know we'd make it that exciting. <laughs> <laughs> Appreciate all you will be back next week. Same bat time, same bat place. We'll see you all then. Bye. Bye.